Yeah, I heard about this damn chase glitch. What no damn glitch. Um, prepare for a lot of cursing because I know that my nieces and nephews know way better than this stupid tomfoolery. So, go on and sit down and get ready to get your feelings hurt if you participated in this tomfoolery. Me, me, me cussing you out is, should be the least of your worries. So, if you ain't heard about the chase glitch, it wasn't no glitch. The chase fraud, go Google it because auntie ain't about to explain no scam because... One thing I'm not doing is playing with no J.P. Morgan Chase. Okay? So you can Google it. To these children out here who did it, because I know what my nieces and nephews, y'all been taught from birth to crawl before you ball, who think you got $150 in your Chase, uh, J.P. Morgan Chase in a bank account. And then all of a sudden, you done uh, magically uh, got $30,000 out of that account, and you think the bank ain't going to come after your behind children then you think well it was their glitch it was their problem in their system so i ain't gonna get in trouble Th this ain't like no uh company advertising that you could get this diamond ring for two dollars instead of twenty thousand dollars and they gotta honor it now nah, this ain't the same thing honey you playing with money with a bank this robbery this check kiting this fraud what's even dumber is your stupid ass is on social media showing people you're doing it. Like literally showing yourself getting money out of the ATM damn machine at Chase. Scammers, they gatekeep. They don't show the scam. Scammers, people that's professional scammers, that's their job. So they're not going to tell nobody how to do that. They're going to charge people to do it for them. And some of y'all paid some of the scammers. Now they got your social and all your information. So in addition to Chase coming after you, they done destroy all your potential whatever for the rest of your life. Y'all dumbasses out here done bought new cars. You got CPN numbers. I'm going to do a whole section on the stupid dumbass shit with CPNs. Who raised y'all? And let me hit y'all with this kicker. TC a big conspiracy theorist. But I think every few years, the banks, and this is just a theory. The banks do shit like this to just lock some motherfuckers up. Just to test out to see what whose stupid ass is going to take part in this. So we can add to the prison, prison industrial complex some more fugs, mugs, uh, and lock their ass up in federal prison. Yeah. Yeah, because they made more money off y'all ass being in prison than they lost in the scam. So, if it's, if it's too easy, sometimes it's meant to be that way. Kind of like them PPP loans.